Okay, hi guys. Some people on Instagram were interested to see how I was um, printing these adorably tiny little photos that I um, use in my Project Life album. Uh, so I just wanted to show you guys how I did that. So I'm using this little printer called a Canon Selfie. Um, apologies for my lighting, I'm just doing it on my desk here. So Canon Selfie, so it's this tiny adorable little printer. It comes in white. I wish I had a white one, but I don't. I have a black one. Um, and it um, connects to your phone through the Wi-Fi, so it's very easy to use. So I'll just quickly show you what I do. Um, so here's my phone here. It's an iPhone 6 Plus. That was my baby boy. Isn't he adorable? Um, so to connect to the printer, it's on, and it'll um, send out this little Wi-Fi network. So here it is, Canon printer 910, whatever that is. So I've, I've joined that network, and then I'm going to go into, I've got a program called PickStitch, which is um, in the App Store, and I use it a lot. Um, and that's just the example of photo. So I wanted to print out a couple of my Instagram photos for my Project Life. So what I did was, I'll just start from the beginning and show you. I go to Layout, and I want to do... Um, So I'll show you how to do this size, this size photo, which is a two by three. So um, this selfie prints out four by six photos, um, and you can print just a full size four by six if you want, but it uses up lots of ink and paper. Um, so I, I sort of prefer these adorably tiny little bits, and then um, I get more photos for each sheet of paper. Um, and so what I'll do, so for for a four by six, you can get four of these little adorable photos. So I'm just going to go in this program and they've got all these options of different ways to put photos together onto one sheet of paper. So I'm going to choose this one to get four photos. And it says start a new collage, yes. And here I've got the option to put my four photos into this um, sheet here. So I'm just going to select four photos to put into each of these little holes. So for example, um, Look, my baby just won an award, so we'll use that one. He's so cute. Proud of him. And how nice is this um, app? Because you can just zoom right in, you know, and crop your photos nice. Like, I could just zoom right in on their faces there and, and crop it in tight like that if I wanted to, you know, since it's so small. Um, and you just sort of do this and pick your four photos like this throughout. So we'll just pick um, that one there, for example, just for fun. Um, and you select your photos and then what I did was there was a little upgrade to the app where you can make these white lines go away so my borders I set to, to nothing and then when I print this out there's no borders and I just cut them cut the little photos on the on the lines you know on the on the non lines there um, once you've got your four photos you just do export to photo album very easy created the image there and now here I'm going to go to my photo album and I just made this little photo here of my Instagram pictures. So what I did was instead of doing four of these two by three photos per page, I just did six two by two photos. They're little squares like Instagram photos. Um, so here I've got my six little Instagram photos and I'm gonna print this onto my selfie. So I just um, have this photo and I click on this little button in the bottom left and I click on print and then the printer is that Canon printer 910 again, the selfie and I just hit print and now my selfie is gonna start to talk to me and say busy and now it's receiving the photo and this printer is so cool guys because um, you just buy the paper for it and it comes in a box, I'll show you um, so the printer and the, the paper and the ink come in this box and um, so it's got the ink and the paper inside there for the selfie and this is the 910 model there's also an 820 that's the older model and in this box you get these little packs of the 4x6 photo paper and you also get these little ink cartridges that just pop into the printer and I like this printer because the ink and the paper 
match up exactly. So you never like left with extra paper or extra ink. It's perfectly like amounted out, you know, it works exactly perfectly to to only print, you know, the sheets that are come in the box, which is nice. And then it just runs the paper back and forth through and it puts the yellow, it puts the pink, it puts the blue. Then it puts like a clear waterproof coating on it. And there you have it. You got your little print here and I just did the four, I mean the six two by two photos on this sheet. And um, that's that there. And um, what you do then is you just crack these ends off of the photo simply like that and then I'll just take my paper cutter and just trim the little squares down to 2 by 2 size and that's it I've got my little tiny photos so it's very simple I just sort of batch process and I do um, on my phone I'll make like six or seven of those collages and then I'll go into my photos and select all seven of the collages in print and it'll just shoot out photos. And then I get these adorable photos. And I, um, to be honest, I mean the quality is good but it's not amazing. Uh, I, you probably get better quality if you take it to Officeworks. But um, for me, having a little baby, it's hard for me to get out of the house like that to keep up with my project life, um, to keep doing my weekly spreads um, all year long. I really just need to print at home. So it's a little bit more expensive. I think it's like 15 cents per picture instead of nine, you know, so you, you're paying a little bit more for the convenience of doing it at home. And the other thing to note about this is that the photo is actually slightly smaller than a four by six. So if you're doing Project Life, um, you might care that it's smaller than the four by six because if you do this photo in the page and you do a four by six, um, like, project life card behind it. You'll be able to see that project life card around the edge because it's slightly bigger. Um, but it doesn't really bother me. Some people might be bothered by that. I mostly cut my photos down small so I don't usually use that 4x6 size anyway. So um, yep, that's all I know about the Canon selfie. I really like it. Um, I use it all the time. It helps me to keep up to date with my project life. So. For that reason, I really love it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it's helpful. Um, ask me any questions. Um, hopefully it didn't go too fast or too slow. I really enjoy interacting with everybody on Instagram. So I um, uh, hope to talk to you guys soon. Bye.